I've been really surprised by the event this year to see so many different uh, representatives from a cross section of transport. I think the next step that is required for us to truly realise a smarter travel solution in the UK will be mobility as a service. Truly integrated transport where it actually makes your journey more convenient it has got to be where the future is going. So I think MAS is an incredibly exciting opportunity for the sector. It really transforms transport from a modal and ticket based and quite a binary relationship with getting around to personalised, flexible and on demand and effectively should increase the use of public transport and on demand transport making mobility and connectivity easier for us all. I think events like this are really important. They play a crucial role. They convene the right sort of people. They convene some really interesting perspectives and thinking, and they give a great platform for some of these innovative new ideas. My work is more on sustainable travel, and so we're seeing the um, development of mobility as a service as a real opportunity to improve uh, the way people access sustainable travel. It's a really good opportunity for everybody to get together and learn a little bit more about each other because this is only going to work with partnership and collaboration. So this is the e-trike. The e this is the next generation, what I see as being the next generation of cycling. The whole bike share thing is a very, very interesting business model. I think it's the future. I don't think people are going to be going to stores to buy bikes for that much longer. The way it's growing so rapidly, um, I can imagine you're getting off a train in a remote area and there being a fleet of these instead of a fleet of taxis. So you just hire one of these and off you go. In Connected Transport at Innovate UK, we are working with a whole host of different um, organisations and bringing them together to try and solve some of the challenges that we're facing in, um, in mobility at the moment. So uh, whether that's congestion, we're looking at customer experience, ticketing, uh, smart infrastructure, so all of the different areas um, that are particularly difficult to overcome at the moment. And we're doing that through a model of collaboration, so we're bringing together the local authorities with the SMEs, with the, the catapults, with academia. It's an opportunity for us, not just from a networking point of view, but you can see some of the solutions and innovations that are about. So the catapult uh, has three core areas of focus for driving innovation. Uh, we're looking at connected and autonomous transport systems, uh, data and mobility as a service. So my role is leading the Mobility as a Service um, initiative to uh, accelerate growth in uh, mass ecosystems. So Mobility as a Service is a user-centred uh, approach that aims to make journeys um, easier, much more efficient, um, more cost-effective. It's an opportunity to build the networks and we all come with the ideas and examples of what we're doing. And when you link up with other people who are like-minded and are interested in that, you get to grow those ideas. And when you share your ideas, other people give you feedback and we, they all get better and better. We all improve. And I think building those networks, really sort of taking some time out to think about what are we actually doing, what are other people doing, and how can we work together to make all of it more impactful is really, really important. I think Smarter Travel Live is a, is a great event. There are lots and lots of people here, lots of organisations, public sector, private sector, SMEs, technology companies. It's so important that it's recognised that no one organisation can achieve intelligent mobility on its own. Atkins recognised this event as, as key to meeting other organisations, igniting the debate and actually putting in place some of the commercial structures and joining up some of the technologies to make intelligent mobility a reality. So it's a key event.